welcome back to python interview coding question and their solution series today i will discuss important question on a string this question may ask you in your l1 and l2 interview round the question is python program to remove the ovals from the strings for any input string we need to check whether it contain ovals or not if it contains some ovals we need to remove it so there are multiple ways that we can solve this problem so here i explain three different approaches to remove the oval from the string so let us start with the first approach in the first approach i am going to compare the character so first of all i'll take the function and name of the function is let's say remove underscore ovals input to the function is let's say string so s1 is a string as an input to the function then we need to print the output after removing the ovals so i'll take the variable output which will hold the string after removing the ovals then i'll iterate every character of the string for i in s1 so every character of the string is going to be compared with if i in the given ovals so for example we know that a e i o and u in small letters we can add it at the capital letter as well in the same list so once i compare the character and if it contain this ovals then we need to discard so i equal to m so we need to remove that particular ovals then we need to update the output so output is equal to previous value of the output plus the character currently we have can in the loop so this will concat a complete string and finally we are going to print the output just i call the function that is remove ovals and input to the function is let's say welcome so what are the number of ovals that have been removed from this string so e o and e three characters will be removed from the string and we'll get the remaining string as output so once i execute the code i'll get wlcm so after removing the ovals we'll get this four character suppose i'll give one more string as input the gokul and i'll compare so gkl is the remain o and u will be removed from this string so this is very simple approach to compare the character with the ovals now we'll talk about the second approach in the second approach we are going to use a replace method first of all i'll take the function that is remove ovals this is my second approach and input to the function is string s1 I am going to store the resultant string as a S1. And first of all, I define the ovals, what type of ovals that I want to replace. So that I'll make as a list. Let's say A, E, U. These are the ovals. Then I am going to iterate for I, N given string so string is s1 if that i in ovals then i update the result is equal to result dot replace i want to replace i with the empty character this process will repeat unless and until it will scan all the characters and then finally after the iteration of loop i'm going to print the result so again i'll call the method remove ovals to an input to the function is let's say welcome i just execute the code the four character has been remain after removing the ovals i'll take another input let's say python which contain only one ovals and i'll execute i'll get this remaining character after removing the ovals so this is the second approach by using replace method now we'll talk about the third approach by using regex method most of the times interviewer asks the solution of this problem by using this method so first of all we have to import the package that is re then i'll write the function remove ovals this is my third approach Input to the function is string. 
and this function will return a string after removing the vowels. Return want to substitute like uh, I want to use that list a i a o u replace with the empty character and input is s1 so i just call the function i also want to print the string after removing the ovals so remove ovals 3 and input to the function is let's say welcome so I just execute it, I'll get the remaining character. I'll take some another input, let's say Python. I'll get this remaining character after removing the ovals. You can take any input, let's say hello, I'm going to take as an input. It consists of many ovals. So once executed, I'll get only three characters H, L, L, E, and O is been removed from this string. So by using these three different methods, we can remove the ovals of any string. Hope you understand all the approaches. Still, if any doubt, you can write it in the comment section. I'll be more happy to give the explanation of your doubt. Thanks for watching this video.